Hey guys, welcome back. It is, uh, it's a stormy day, actually. It's been storming all day, and it's supposed to storm all afternoon, but uh, I just got out of work, and the sun is shining, so I really need to go down to the river. I've had kind of a rough day, so I'm gonna go down to the river um, to the nearest possible spot, which happens to be the spot that I took the kids last time and see if I can get, you know, some fish in between this, these storms. Um, I don't know much about low pressure stuff or high pressure stuff or pressure fronts in general, but uh, if you guys do, maybe you could comment down below and explain it to me a little bit better, or I could just look it up, you know, like a normal person, not a lazy person. <laughs> but uh, anyway, headed down to that same spot. People are passing me because I'm going slow. And uh, I don't know, I need this today. And it's like God just kind of put a pause on the storm so I could go do this. So let's go do this. All right, guys, if this looks familiar, it should. Um, back at the creek I was at with the kids. I'm going to be throwing this guy again because he was working really well for us. I know you'd probably prefer a change of scenery, but just because of the fact that there's probably some time restraints here given that the storm won't hold out forever. I gotta do this in a timely fashion. There's one. Little fighter. Get away from that log. Woo! Yes. Nice. Whoa, I just cast it right under that tree there because I knew I knew there had to be somebody under there. Come here, you. Gotcha. Not a big one. Little baby. Little red-eyed baby. Cast it right under that tree there. Sorry I didn't get that on camera. Uh, all right, Gary. Thanks for coming to see me. Bye. All right. First one of the day. I've only been here probably 10 minutes. Is moving down this creek here. See if anybody else is under there. Hitting a lot of bumps there. Probably gonna get snagged. Oh, trick shots. Oop, that felt like a bump. That's a snag. <laughs> oh man, I think it broke off. Yep. Shoot. Alright, let's see what else I got. Okay, I actually found another one of these little swim baits. Um, this is just the, the Dix brand. I think it's Jawbone. But this is my my confidence lure for smallmouth. Found another one in my backpack. And I could use some confidence right now. So that's what we're going for. Written in the stars above. Oh, damn. Oh crap. Bet you that was a pike. That's dumb. All right, I only have one more of those little guys left, but I'm going to switch over to another confidence bait here. Just in case that whatever's over there doesn't want to go after the same thing again. In case it realized, oh, hey, this is rubber. That's not very tasty. Oh, no, oh, no, 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 no. Oh my gosh, <laughs> thought it was snagged. <laughs> oh my lord, that was ridiculous. Oh, what is it with me and ridiculous catches, guys? There we go. <laughs> Came flying out of that snag up there, landed over here, and this guy smoked it. That's funny. It's another little guy. It's pretty beaten up there. All right, see ya, fella. Thanks for uh, surprising me like that. Always happy to see you over a snag. Boom! <laughs> that was funny. Oh man, he destroyed my grub. Well, you know how they say you should always start fishing closer to you so you don't scare the other fish? I think that was as close to me as I could possibly get. 
Hope my battery doesn't die and I can get one more fish here. Woo! Money. Oh, the fart. Man. Something little in there wants this. This thing is breaking apart. So what we're going to do is we're going to rip this in half because it's not going to stay on the hook anyway. I'm going to use this smaller section. My hook is bent. Maybe that's why I'm mission fish. Mission fish. Basically very small body in the tail. Let's see if we can get whatever this little nibbler is over here. Keep stealing my tails and such. Suddenly just feel the need to cast this way. And get snagged? Where am I? I'm not even sure where I am. I can't see where I am. I might be fishing on the bank for all I know. I just feel something over here. I just feel it in my bones. Got him. My bones were right. <laughs> Whoa, is that a huge perch? That is a jumbo perch. Oh my lord. Get up here. Whoa. That's a jumbo. Oh my lord. Look at this fish. Look at this perch. <laughs> okay, chill, chill. That is... That could be my personal best perch. I don't do a whole lot of perch fishing, but that's a big perch to me. That's beautiful. Right, look at those orange. Man, beautiful fish. I'm going to try to get a picture of him. All right. I'm going to release this guy. Because I don't eat anything out of this river. Just as a rule. So, Mondo Perch. Last look. See ya. There he goes. That was cool. That was an unexpected catch. Is that a bug on in my pants? What's happening? Or is that just the quarter making its way down my pocket? I don't know. <laughs> Fart! My gosh! I keep missing this fish. And he's just destroying my swim bait. He still wants it though. I don't understand what's going on. Oh my gosh, it's so annoying. Oh, ha. There he is. I swear this fish has gotten off like 15 times. <laughs> he's got him down. Hopefully. <laughs> oh, it's a nice... Oh, he's gone! <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> <sighs> mm hmm Mm-hmm. For like two seconds, I was like, oh, that's perfect timing. These people were walking by. Now I look like an awesome fisherman. And that was karma. That was karma. <laughs> He's done. He don't want it no more. All right. All right, guys, that'll do it for me. Um, that last one was a little disappointing, I know, but... Uh, We'll get them next time. Um, I was able to get down here and clear my head, and the storm held off, which is amazing. It's clear blue skies, so I'm going to go home, and I'm going to do another little thing I like to do, and do some gardening, and uh, I'll see you guys on the next one. Thanks for coming along. See you next time.